everybody, I'm Lisa behind the cameras. Build together we are Belisa. Welcome to our channel. We got up this morning, got a few chores done. Bill got the video that's running today up and got everything taken care of for that. Bill came downstairs and asked me to join him for a walk. Came into the kitchen and noticed this. The glass in the door of our microwave is shattered. We don't know what happened because neither of us have even used the microwave in the last 24 hours. Or longer. Or longer. But now <laughs> we've brought these towels in because we're going to have to figure out what to do to replace it. And we just already, I don't know if you can see this, but glass is already falling out oh, of it. Open the door. Okay. Carefully. Okay. The, the handle may come out of the glass. I know. Okay. Oh my gosh. That is crazy. So we're going to have to look up the model. Really can't see. There's not enough light in there. Oh, look at the whole edge piece. Yeah. You're rough on things, honey. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's just my big muscles. All right, we're going to continue on with our day and figure out what we need to do to replace this. We put the box underneath so that when we take the screws out, it doesn't come crashing down. We're hoping that it'll just kind of balance on this box so that we can get it out easily. But as we took the vent pipe out, we can see that something's been living up in there, so we gotta clean it out. What? What is that? Okay, this is what we found in there. Something big got up in there. It looks like maybe a wasp nest was getting started or something. I don't know, I'm glad we got it out though. <laughs> Bill already got one screw out and oh my gosh, look how long it is. I'm working on getting the screw out on this side. We got the two screws out. Those two screws were the only thing holding the microwave in. I am now gonna make sure that the cord is through the hole so that it's not holding anything up because we're going to take the microwave outside. We've got a nice hole in our kitchen, but we got the microwave out without too much hassle. We have to go outside now and measure it. We have to make sure we get the exact same size microwave to fit in this spot perfectly. All right, so this is just under 30 inches. It's just 29 and 3 quarters inches. Put that in my phone. Okay, the height. I've opened the microwave up because here's the information with the model number. So I'm going to take a picture so that I have that when we get to Lowe's. All right, I got it. Beautiful. We've made it to Lowe's. Let's head inside and find a microwave. I got my mask. Appliances. All right, we found a microwave that we think is an upgraded model from what we have in our house. So we're going to get the measurements and make sure it's going to fit perfectly in our space. So they don't have the microwave in stock that we need and it's going to take over two weeks to get it. We tried to come to a box store to buy it, but it looks like Amazon's going to get our business again. We've made it home and we found the exact same microwave on Amazon. $30 less than it was going to cost us at Lowe's and we're going to get it in approximately four to five days sooner. Free shipping, so we're getting it shipped to the house. Unfortunately, we don't have it today to install, but we'll be getting it soon, and then we'll have a microwave again. <laughs> Let's continue on with our day. 
I'm going to starve. She only knows how to cook in a microwave. <laughs> Since we can't hook up the microwave today, we thought we would come over to the campground, have some lunch, and go in the pool. We got Red Robin, yum, and I'm hungry. Let's eat, then we'll be back for some swimming. Let's go swimming. We made it to the pool. Is that your bike? Did you park your bike right there with the flowers? That's my flowery bike. It's fancy. That's a fancy one. All right, I brought my Mickey blanket and I got a perfect lounger. So most days around here is too hot to lay out. Way too hot to even be out by the pool, but today it's only about 88 degrees per minute. I'm going to check the water temperature. <laughs> Yesterday we went to the front for No, no. Just a member. Just a member. Oh yeah, that's what we do. Oh, what do you Yeah, we're we're um YouTubers for that's that's what we do. Oh, because I saw you film that. I thought they must be working for thousands of trails because you were doing the auction. Yeah, no, I wanted that rig, but I only wanted it for twenty-five grand. We were at thirty-five. I, I oh, you're at yeah. I can't believe it went for fifty. How much did that motorhome go for? Fifty-two. Oh, I would have never paid that. Magic! Magic! Yeah. Oh no! All right. To see if you can be trusted in the pool. Of Alone, yeah. you have to be able to be able to swim up and back. Can you do that? I think I can. <laughs> That's what I used to always make the kids do. If you can show me you can swim up and back, then I'll leave you alone in the pool. Am I head in the water or out? Doesn't I don't matter. care. Don't matter. Okay. If you can get there and back. Oh, I don't think she can make it. She can make it. She's going to need a lifeguard on duty. <laughs> it is work. Well, you just ate that whole burger. I know. That's what's making you sink. Yay, she made it. We had a good time at the pool talking to some people that were at the auction and it was really nice i met a new youtuber here which is amazing but i just got a call i gotta go get some work done so we're wrapping up we're gonna head out of here but i gotta rinse off the shower first i hope you enjoyed our video don't forget to smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe bye